What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBASafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K20 My Team video and guys today we got new content out of nowhere and I'm honestly kind of hyped about it. Before we get into the video make sure to smash that like button, drop the sub and all that good stuff because that would be greatly appreciated. Make sure to smash the like button, make sure to drop the sub because bro we're on the grind and honestly we got new content today. I'm hyped. Guys, thank you guys for all the support. We're going to hit 9k today. Literally we're so close to 9k. Please drop this out. Also, follow the Twitter down below. We're going to sell MT and buy MT on there. Let me know. I got all the, I got everything. PS4 and Xbox MT for the cheapest, reliable price. Let me know. Guys, so we got new content. I'm honestly hyped about this. We got Big Daddy, Big Country. We got Rick Schmitz, who's going to be a god. Chauncey Billups. We got Darnell Armstrong. He's going to be pretty decent, too. Pretty good bunch of player. And we got Steve Cheese Novak. So let's get into this content. This is crazy. Let me pull some. Oh, I pulled the wrong one. Damn it. But anyways, yeah, let's pull some packs. I'm feeling some packs. Let's get lucky. We're going to pull some packs for this. Let's go. And then we're going to get into some. You know what? You know what? You know what? Let's get into some stats first. So Chauncey Billups, let's check if he's on the auction. We just got a brand new Opal. His diamond is a god. So like if his diamond's a god, I can't even imagine the Opal. There's one up on Xbox. 99.99. I didn't even know these dropped. But here it is, man. 97, 95 mid range. This is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like this. Um, really good stats. He's 6'3. He has good rebounding too. Great speed. He's a really good card. Let's check out his bat. He's gotta have the Hall of Fame, everything. He's got 42 hauls, bro. This card is good. He's got every single badge you want. This card's good. All I'm gonna say is that he is obviously kind of small. That's one flaw. What are we going to do, man? That is... I'll take it, I guess. Rick Schmitz, dude. I feel like this card is so good every year. And I feel like this card might be a budget baller. Let's see. I think he's like 7'3", right? 7'4". Woo! He's dirty. He's dirty. He's got a great 3, a 97 mid-range, an 80 dunk, a 95 standing. Okay. Block, 89. Probability, 74. Interior defense, 92. I kind of like this card as well. 73 speed. Okay. It's pretty solid for a 7'4 beast. Let's see, does he have range? If he has gold range, it's a wrap. If he has Hall of Fame quick draw as well, it's a wrap. He probably has gold and gold. He has no range. Okay, I mean, he is 7'4". To be honest, I've been rocking the new bowl. He's been absolutely amazing for me, so that's pretty cool. Let's go over to Bryant Reeves, Mr. Big Country himself. So, Rick Schmitz, my comparison is Manu Bowl. my opinion. Manu Bowl is going to be the guy I rock with all year. He's been amazing for me. He's been amazing. I mean, he's locked up every center in the game. I personally, in my opinion, Dino Raja and Manu Ball are the best centers, in my opinion, in this game for the price, by far. Um, I use Kareem. Kareem's obviously amazing. I think Kareem's the best defensive interior player. I think Shaq's more of a four. I think Bol Bol's more of a four. I think Dino and Rick Schmitz and Manu Ball could be really good centers this year, and I think they could be definitely top centers. So definitely think he's worth it if you get the rice right. Now we got the man, Big Country. Now, Caldy is a big fan of this guy. He loves him. I don't know why. Um, but here it is. 79 three-point shot. 92 mid-range. Great post moves. Great post hook. Great post fade. This is cool. Now, he has an 85 driving dunk as, as well. 92 block. Perimeter D73. Interior defense pretty solid as well. This card's a beast. He's 7 foot. So, he's not too small. He's a 7 foot center. I mean, nowadays, bro, with Taco and all them, he's pretty small, which is kind of crazy. But he is 7 foot. And he has 29 holes. Let's check out the stats. Let's see the stats real quick. Okay, this card's pretty cool too. Does he have gold range? He doesn't have range, right? Yeah, he has no range either. I mean, he isn't that quick. Wait, what was his speed? I don't know how I feel about this card. He's probably really slow, correct? 75 speed, 62 ball. That's terrible. If you're really going to waste your MT on that card, go ahead. It's not worth it in my opinion, man. You know how it goes. Like straight up, Dino Raja is literally going to be the best center in the game for a long time. He's literally Giannis at center. So... Let's go Steven Novak. Um, this car has got to have a 98 plus 3. This is the cheese head, bro. 98. Like I said, this card is going to be a god in the corner. 
Steve Novak, I was, I'm was i a Knicks fan, bro. If you guys remember the year where he literally broke the three-point record, he sat in the corner all game. He literally camped in the corner and made every shot. He was a cheese ball. He made every shot. This card is going to be sick. He's going to have Hall of Fame range. He's going to have decent defense, 85 perimeter, 875 steal. It's pretty slow, 83 speed, but yo, he's got to have all, yeah. Hall of Fame range, Hall of Fame quick draw. This card is going to be my favorite card in the game. I'm a Knicks fan. Steve Novak in the corner. It's auto threes. It's literally auto threes. This card is going to be sick. Um, I'm a huge fan of this card. For an Amethyst, it's going to be 5K, maybe less. I'm going to try to pick him up. My, I'm probably going to get some gameplay with him. And then we got that other diamond card, Darnell Armstrong. I don't know whoa, how tall he is. I'm pretty sure Darnell Armstrong... I don't even know how to sell his name, say his name, to be completely honest. I think that's completely off. But you know what? It's Darrell Armstrong. <coughs> that's my bet. <laughs> 25K. Six foot. There it goes. He's not good. 97 dunk. That's insane. That is insane. Great defense. Um, 95 speed. I don't know. They could have gave him a better speed. But that's six foot. They could have gave him at least a 97, 96. Quick draw clamps ankle breaker for sure right he's gotta have ankles he's gotta have ankles all right yeah so he has hall of fame ankles okay gold range oh, he's gold ankles all right uh, six foot point guard he's not gonna he's not gonna fly you know there's so many kids with Giannis. there's so many kids with tall point guards right now um let's check out who else did i miss somebody else um armstrong og yeah that's it so that content's pretty cool now honestly this content is cool because it does drop the prices of the other cards so that's kind of cool so we're actually gonna hop into this let's see if we get an opal bro we get an opal if we get my boy rick schmitty if we get one of these cards that would be so fire because i'm dying i'm dying to get a pull i haven't had a pull since last week <laughs> i'm just kidding bro like honestly i had really good pulls with 2k's luck with 2K's luck and all, I don't know. We'll see, I guess. New content's cool. I'm always loving the new content. To be honest, this is not the best content. It's really not. It's kind of just a place filler. It's just a playoff spotlight sim type of thing. To be honest, I had no idea he's dropped. Thank God for Shake and Bake. He's back in action. And it makes sense. Um, I, I literally had no idea this drop. This dropped out of nowhere. No tweets, no nothing. Of course, Shake and Bake's the man. The man, the goat, the goat. The goat is back and he's here. And honestly, I feel like these cards aren't even packs. There literally was like no Chauncey Billups. There is literally no Kuzma. So like, I don't know, dude. The way 2K has been working with their servers and everything, it doesn't look like these packs are actually like good, like going good. I haven't really seen Chauncey Billups. When you only see one or two, it's kind of iffy. And especially with the prices and the market and all that good stuff right now, these packs are kind of scary to pop. But we're going to continue to just try our best. We're going to stay positive. And we're going to hope for the best. Now, I'm just so happy, guys. If you do know, Shake and Bake is back. He is my favorite My Team YouTuber forever. I've been watching him since I was 13. He's the one who really wanted... He, he's really the one who made, it, made me want to play 2K. Like, I've been watching Shake and Bake since 2K13 glitches, bro. And honestly, he honestly... Like, everything he says, you have to listen to. You cannot disrespect Shake and Bake. He's been in the game for so long. He's literally my favorite YouTuber. I love when he rants. I love everything about the guy. And I'm just so glad to see him back. As we get an Amethyst there, can we get Steve Novak? If we get Steve Novak, that's how we're going to end the video. We're going to end the video. We're not going to get him. Damn it. Who is that? Is that Kyrie? I swear, bro. These packs are broken. Like, I haven't... I feel like these Spotlight Sims packs are truly broken. And honestly, what was that? Like, seven packs in and I got nothing? I don't know how I feel about these packs. I'm going to be honest with you guys. They're really not good. I, I don't know why I just quick sold me. Actually goes for MT. They're just not good. The packs that you really want to pull are the, the more high tier packs. Let's see if we can maybe pull an opal in this last pack. I'm just never a fan of these. Like we said, we got a ruby. Oh my god. At least he's going for a little something. But yeah. To be completely honest with you guys, that's really all we got for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, you we'll see more content later. Probably Steve Novak gameplay. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.